comfortable in those situations to catch a ball one hand to do whatever. And uh, I was fortunate to catch a the ball there and finish with a nice goal at the end of the uh, quarter. Did you know right away that you had it out of your stick in time? Uh, no, but I know if I celebrated fast enough that the refs would have felt bad, I hope. <laughs> our fans have a big uh, influence on how we play. I feel like uh, playing our first game here against Richmond, uh, seeing our four or however many we had here, but uh, I, I like playing off the fans and uh, their, their chants and stuff get me going and uh, I feel like that's what really helped push me through these two games. I grew up playing like, I, I grew up, box is way more physical than this and um, I grew up my whole life playing box indoor and like it's just another game. Um, it's gonna, it's nice to have a couple days off to uh, heal and stuff but it's, it's lacrosse, it's gonna happen. It's uh, it's always fun. I, I like the uh, aggressiveness that teams bring out and I like, uh, I try to get in other teams' heads. We didn't play our best at uh, the Yale the first time. I feel like we fell apart uh, that game against Yale. We weren't we weren't ourselves. We weren't having fun. And uh, I know we'll, I know what we got to do to uh, be better for that next game. Have you thought ahead to what it's going to be like on Championship weekend to play in a you know stadium with 40, 50,000 people? There's 40, 50,000 people that go. I know there have been in the past. Wow, uh, that's going to be incredible. Uh, Never really played in a fan base that big, uh, but it's gonna be, it's gonna be fun. I know uh, I know we'll have our fans there, and I know it's it's gonna be fun to play in front of.